this request. Hello? Yes, sir. Uh, I see that. Yeah. So, uh, my intention is uh, just to make uh, multiple uh, requests. Uh, like this one like this one uh, for example i have this uh, request uh, maybe multiple uh, for multiple uh, business application uh, maybe this one is business application one two three but i need to use uh, only one uh, request route and uh, to access access and these multiple, these multiple applications, applications. Forward to, uh, to one response. Mm, sure. So uh, over here, uh, I may I have uh, this request as so, well uh, on my first HTTP input. Uh, I send this. Uh, for example, uh, let let we take this one is the name of the business application sale list. So if it, the business application name is sale list, it uh, routes to uh, business application one. Uh, if uh, the business application name, let us say HH, it, uh, it uh, routes to business application two. So uh, how do I make uh, this one using the SOAP request? Uh, what are the message flow that we currently have? Yes. That in toolkit. Okay. Now add a uh, print subflows. Yes. Create a new uh, subflow. Okay. Let I create a new application. No, no. Uh, okay. Click on cancel. Okay. On yeah, so, uh, flow for this. Uh, where is the? What is the project name for this flow? Uh, I didn't create it for that, sir. So okay, let's create a new application. Yes. Uh, close all the other uh, projects. Okay. Okay. Here, sir, I have created the project name is sample multiple request. Huh? At HTTP uh, listener, input and output node. Okay. Input, yeah. And then apply. Yeah. Yeah. Now, uh, click on uh, the project. Sample multiple request. New. Okay. Yes. S U B F L O W. Second option. Okay. Give some business application okay. one. Okay. Click on finish. Can I make this uh, the same uh, schema, right? Yes. In the same way, create other two uh, applications. Business application two and business application three.
Go back to the main flow. Sample request dot message flow. This one. Yes. Okay. Can I drag this re into this one? Not required. It's in the same uh, schema. Uh, drag the application one route subflow into okay. uh, this main flow. The white space. Drag that. Okay. Here. And no. Towards the right. Move it towards the right. Here. Yes. Okay. Do the same thing for the other two. Now, uh, add a complete loop. Okay. Yes. Compute. Okay, and then connect it to application one. Uh, okay. Application one. Now two output two to application two. Okay. Three to application. Output of this loops to yes. Uh, HTTP reply. Output to HTTP. Hey, right. Output HTTP reply. Also three. <coughs> Double click. Uh, complete both. Okay. Uh, press enter. This one. Yeah, remove that. Right? Propagate P R O P A G A T E to terminal P O two okay. space terminal P E R M I N. Uh, yeah, right. Within single quotes, in small okay. letters, out okay. one. Single quote uh, again, and then semicolon. Uh, and then uh, return false. Okay. Now copy and paste this uh, inside a if condition. Sorry. On what? If on the next line, if uh, yeah. If, if input root dot XML MSC XML MSC dot uh, so uh, something um. go to your uh, postman and copy the root uh, tag. I think, I think this one, right? Copy same message on line number two. This one. Okay. Yes. To toolkit, put a star. Yes. Type hmm. yes. Okay. Plural. So you have to use this uh, method okay. to uh, understand if that uh, value is present at that X path. Okay. And, uh, if uh, it returns yes, then you have to get to that uh, terminal. Then right. Ah yes. After return false, you can end if. If. Yeah, that's it. 
I hope this must be deleted. Uh, this must be deleted, right? Ah, oh, yes. So here there is an error. How you can create one message group and route it to three different uh, business applications? What? I think you're not able to hear me properly, but I said this is not the same. Okay. Uh, use one application to send the same message to three different applications based on the preload. Oh, okay. Uh, okay. Uh, I think there is syntax error over here. That's because the spelling for exist is incorrect. E X I S T S. 